Hi everyone, my name is Viv Munn and I'm a lecturer at, on the interior design co course at TAFE. I'll tell you a little bit about the interior design course. Uh, the college runs a two-year diploma of interior design and a three-year advanced diploma of interior design. Uh, uh, presently, we deliver face-to-face. -face. Both courses are taught by industry experienced lecturers who have an extensive wealth of knowledge of the industry and we work constantly with industry to keep you in touch with their needs and requirements. Uh, we produce students who are ready for the workforce, so I think that's probably one of the most important things um, coming to TAFE, about coming to TAFE. Uh, many of the projects that we give to students are live projects with real clients, briefs and drawings. Um, we do lots of visits, we go to different suppliers, we visit design practices, uh, and we also look at current building design, um, especially interiors, because we want the students to feel inspired and see what's really happening out there. Um, we also invite industry to give presentations on products, materials, and what it's like um, working as an interior designer in their de design practice. We've got many successful graduates working in the industry and they're always willing to come back into TAFE and give back and tell us about, share their industry experience because that's probably one of the most daunting things for a student when they leave TAFE. Uh, we pride ourselves in delivering knowledge and skills to work in the industry when the students graduate and employers do look to us for graduates to join their business or practice. Yeah, the course has been delivered for many, many years and lots of professionals in the industry are graduates at TAFE. So lots of people, our reputation has been around a long time. Uh, Anyone who takes a, a TAFE graduate knows that they will be familiar with the design process, the building regulation, how things are done in the real world and be able to present their work professionally and confidently. Um, and also the be, you'd be able to use a lot of the software that industry uses. Uh, we are constantly changing the course and updating the course to meet industry demands and to, 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 you know, to, to be doing something that, that is required in the industry. The students gain competency in Photoshop, InDesign, AutoCAD, SketchUp, Lumion, and at the present the advanced diploma students are using Revit. So yeah, we we do a lot of um, we help them with a lot of the software. So the course covers a wide range of subjects as well as learning learning to design, which is the basis of the course for interior spaces. Students learn about the history of design, they learn about colour, they learn about hard and soft materials, lighting, uh, they learn how they learn hand drawing skills, they learn about the design process, they do a lot about sustainability, which is so important these days, professional practice, and even how to present, we give them, we've got a class on which will help them with verbal presentations and preparing the portfolio. Well, by the end of the diploma course, students will have a portfolio of work which really does help them um, achieve, you know, be successful in a job interview. Uh, diploma students often find um, work in specialised retail outlets, they sell products, furniture, materials, they get jobs as colour consultants, in home staging um, and in addition they work for project home builders as well and residential homes is a big market for them as well. Advanced diploma students, they still can work in the residential area but many choose the commercial field and they'll be working in architectural design practices, they'll be working for a builder, um, a kitchen designer, um, yeah, any building firm. So lots of avenues open for them. So look, I'll touch on a few of the highlights. The Crosby Tiles uh, are a long established tile supplier in Perth with showrooms in Osmond Park and Mayuri. 
uh, we annually carry out a competition known as the Crosby Challenge, which is a real life uh, project with industry. Um, students are given a brief to follow from Crosby, asking them to design a bathroom with a given theme um, using their tiles. Um, we also involved uh, Polytech, which is a laminate company, and um, students also use their products in their design. Polytech Laminates, an industry panel of, judge, of judges select the awards. So it's, it's a real life project and they give feedback to the students. Um, the prize, they also give prizes to the students. Um, and the boards are on display in the showrooms at Myrie and um, Austin Park. And the general public are invited to view the work and vote on it. And they're actually given a People's Choice Award. We also have an opening night with Crosby's at the Osborne Park showroom and the certificates and prizes awarded. Um, so there's a lot of, comp it produces a lot of uh, competition uh, with, the grad with the students and there's also lifts the level of work. We get some fantastic results with this competition. We also run a, 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 a competition with Blum Kitchens um, they run a workshop for the students at their showroom in Osmond Park. Um, students are exposed to the latest state of art uh, fixtures and fittings and various hardware uh, that is used in kitchen design. They also see how kitchens are put together and then students de design a kitchen themselves, which they present to Blum. And again, Blum go away, make a decision about the work and award applies uh, the best design from each group. We also have at the end of, of the advanced diploma course, we have an exhibition. Um, the advanced diploma students organise a graduate award night exhibition with in conjunction with the lecturers, which showcases their portfolio of work along with the a presentation board which showcases the best of their work. Uh, people from the industry attend the exhibition night and they're often looking for people or graduates to employ or they might keep a record of them and, and contact them when they have an opening in their business. And we also receive feedback from industry about about the course and what we're delivering and the standard of work of the students. Um, so it's a really good for, for everybody. Evening also gives the students a chance to meet and network, network with industry and to present themselves professionally as an interior design graduate. And we also celebrate their success on finishing the course and the course and the three years of hard work that they've done. Um, and the exhibition is open for a week for viewing by um, the public. So thank you everyone for listening. I hope it's given you a little bit of insight into the course. We're always willing to help you. Um, the details will be at the end of this presentation and we look forward to maybe seeing or hearing from you in the future. Thank you. <laughs>